Hello everybody, welcome back to 7 Days to Die. We are in the Darkness Falls mod on day 116. I started recording not long after the other one, but the audio was lagging really, really bad, so I cut feed, fixed the problem, and then restarted, so we're at 529. But that's fine because I am getting my book made, uh, which is my mastery for the farming, which means I can finally put some of that food into use. Speaking of the foods into use, I need to... Go say hi to Dean, and I need to go put my scarecrows out here to watch my stuff and things. Uh, let's put you over here. Like this. And I do apologize if you hear the sounds of storms. Uh, there's a football player in my stuff. But we have got a storm coming in. Which will hopefully not affect my recording at all. We'll, we'll see. I like these. And I got a couple of dudes. Uh, where? Oh, where? I'll put you over here. Okay. And kind of need some people out here watching my trees, too. So let me do these. And before anybody asks, no, the, they're not actually working as scarecrows. It's not- it does- the game doesn't work that way. Okay, uh, I need to pick all of this. Mainly because I need the coconuts that are in the back, but it's time to actually get started making some of these awesome recipes that are supposed to have secondary effects. There we go. That gave me 29 coconuts. Not bad for the first harvest. Dude, you already scared me. I thought you were a zombie. <laughs> Tag comment. <laughs> I don't really care for mannequins, but the fact that they're selling them makes them cool. Come out here, guys. I, I don't want you messing around with my stuff. Uh, thanks, but I think I actually have enough blueberries, right? Yeah, I have enough blueberries. Okay, um... Oh yeah, I have one more mannequin. Where am I gonna put you? Okay, I am not taking out that yucca right this second because I have got so much yucca already, it's fine. Okay, so that gave me... Oh, daggummit, I restarted so I just shifted all of my stuff. Anyway, I did restart. The audio seems to be going better now, so not a big deal. It's just acting up, which is fine. And I do have tomatoes, and I have to turn those into... Here, let me take this, take that. And I have to turn them into tomato juice. Okay. Um, well, if I'm not gonna have animals, I might as well break this down. And make it look like an actual pig thing? Not, not pig thing. Farm? That was unnecessary. And put more of those because the eggs are a whole lot more useful than anything else. So why not? There we go. That's more of an accent. All right. I am good with these. No weapons in the house. Are you done with the juice? It's gonna take a little while for the juice. Is my book done? Okay. Book is done. There we go. Farmer is done. Master Farmer. Now the only one I need left is... Scavenger? Let's make sure. <clears throat> scavenger and Hunter. Scavenger and Hunter. That's, that's the two that I needed. Okay, now one of the things that I need is... What is it? Yeast and coconut? Herbal antibiotics and pure mineral water. I think that those are different things altogether. Uh, like roast stunner, I need potatoes, carrots, grilled meat, batter. I need to know how to make batter, which is a bowl of water, flour, and eggs. I've got several bowls of water now. Bowl of water, eggs, flour? flour. Um, I 
Looks like it cooks in my hand. Can I do batter over here? Nope. Can I do batter here? Yes. Okay, well you do the batter. And what else did I need? I needed... Dough. Uh, make dough. Do those. Sure. Uh, so I need more eggs, and I've already redone those, so let me make some more uh, recipes. Chicken coops. I need uh, plant fiber, which I took out a whole bunch of stuffs. So... How many of those can I make? 57. I don't think I need quite that many. What I need is... Let's do 20. Craft those in my pocket. And... Let me see... And I need to grill some meat. Alright, grill all that meat. There we go. So that's for those two recipes. What did I need for the other one? Oh, banana pancakes. I'm gonna have to make a whole lot more batter, though. Mm, apple pie. I wonder if that gives you anything different. Animal fat. Apples. Uh, okay, I'll make a whole bunch of those. That's fine. What else could we make? Um, I'm not sure which one is better, gumbo stew or... Okay. <clears throat> okay, so for the gumbo stew, either one I need... Not soup, it's stock. And... Peas. Uh, that, and what was it, water? No, that's not it. I can make paper? Okay. Okay, Gumbo Stew craft one of those, and the other one that needed it was Shepherd's Pie. Uh, Shepherd's Pie... And you need the lamb ration. Okay. Ear of corn and potato. Ear of corn and potato. Uh, shepherd's pie. Crap, one of those. Okay, give it just a minute and we're going to figure out what that does. I also, at the end of the stream, I had made another... Mm, another science crafting thing. I read it during the ed episode... Well, the beginning part of the episode where the audio was messing up and I had to cut. I had to... I went ahead and read it, but I I thought I had two levels already open, so maybe not. Oh, that's three. I yeah, see, I've got levels, but I actually want to go in towards things. I'd rather get the pages. It's completely doable to get pages. Uh, what else am I waiting on? I'm waiting on these to get done, and I'm waiting on those to grill. So I can make some of that. I am waiting on these. Uh, pasta. I do three of those. We're gonna find out which each one of these things do, and then we're gonna see which ones I need to invest stuff in and what I need to focus on getting. There. Uh, as far as I know, all of this is POI, not character made, so these should definitely work. Uh, what else am I missing? Uh, I need to work on the horde base as well. So, did I have... Yes, I've got these. I have got these. I've got a few blocks left. Concrete. How's concrete production going? Uh, very, very good. Uh, very good. These are stopped up. Okay. 
So we've got plenty of concrete. Uh, the problem might be the rebar frames. Uh, you are doing good. I think you are complete. Uh, that's still taking its time, and then we have that little bit left. Um, did I have any more that I needed to smelt down? There's a couple of items I needed to use this for. Um, I could probably, most definitely, get some more steel going. I've got so much upgrades that need to happen. Uh, so... I've got forged iron, forged steel. Uh, just do all of that. Keep it going. Um... As a matter of fact, since that one is done, uh, favorite that recipe because... Yeah, favorite that one. Uh, craft all of those. I mean, the sooner those things get done, the sooner I can make some major upgrades and get it upgraded to steel. So... Okay, I've got that pasta done. I've got the batter. Is that all the pasta I can make? No. Okay, um... What did I need for on, uh, recipes? Okay, so one of each of these, and yeah, I need those. One takes raw meat, I think. Uh, gumbo stew, meat bolognese. But but I don't know how you say that. To be honest with you, uh, we've got that one, and then the vegetable one is what. Vegetable. Corn and carrot. Corn and carrot. Okay. Craft that one, and then... I need what for the roast dinner? I've got it. Okay, craft one of those. Uh, you do all of that, and we're just going to compare them all. Speaking of meds, how are we doing on said meds? I could use a few more first aid kits and a few more first aid bandages. Okay, ten will work. Um, apparently I need to keep you going a lot longer than that because you're not going to get done with everything. Okay, that should get you done. And first aid bandages, I need those and take those. These now, do you have to do the first aid? Uh, uh First aid bandages, bandage, and aloe cream. So you actually have to turn them into a bandage first. I know it seems like I'm piddling around a lot. I'm getting a whole lot of stuff in. Hopefully, this will give me a whole bunch of eggs. So after I find out what these things do, I'll be able to remake the recipes that I want when I want them. Okay, all the grilled meat is done. At the very least, I can- oh, kidoki. I guess I'm sticking a couple of stacks in here. That's- that's fine. All right. um, I guess I'll wait until I get very, very hungry, and then I'll eat one, and then I'll write down what they do, and then I'll come back to it. Uh, first aid. I need the aloe cream. Uh huh, I can make these in the work batch. How high do you stack, though? I think you only stack to 10. But I'm making 35 bandages, so I'll, I'll, it should stack into one after it's done. Despan. What can I make with you? Grandpa's Learn Elixir, which I can make. Ooh, okay. Dog foods? I've got so much dog foods. Uh, let's see, I need red tea. I don't have a lot of red tea. I can make more red tea. Uh, how much acid do I have? That could be the problem. I got a lot of acid. I got a lot of that. I don't think I can make acid. Can I? Bottle of acid. I can make it colon water. Oh. Okay. Um, let me put that up. That's just a random thing sitting in here and. That's random things sitting in here. Okay, um, 
So I need that bottle of acid. I need the beers. And uh, what else? Uh, no, no, no. For the learn elixir. Oh, I can make it now. Okay. Uh, let's get as many of those going as I possibly can. Uh, let's put a whole lot more fire on you because you are going to be going for a while. Um, actually, which one is cheaper? Uh, is it over here that's cheaper? Yes. I can do nine. Now, what is my hold up? It is the red tea, which I have got plenty of stuff to make as soon as I find them. Thank you. Uh, red tea. Am I gonna need 65? Possibly. Craft it. Do it. Do the thing. Okay, uh, put that here. Um, do I have any hops already? I have 39 hops. What does it take to make the beer? Uh, murky water and hops. So if I take a couple of these, not that, and do this. That, did I not? I didn't pick up the hops flower. Daggummit. I knew that. I knew that. Okay. I can only make nine of them. Oh boy. I need a lot more of that. Uh, you've got 11, 12, 20 minutes. Okay, you got plenty of fuel. That's fine. Okay, I've got a lot of this. What all can I put you into? Anti-venom, four bites. Grandpa's moonshine, which does wood. Melee damage. And a bunch of other stuff. Well, hmm. Pumpkin cheesecake, which takes eggs. A uh, recog. Takes the acid, accelerated healing shot, gotta go fast, physical conditioning, steroids, and the transhuman shot. So actually those go into a later tier thing, so I'm not going to worry about using those. Uh, these sandwiches will probably go in towards making that. I could make some more anti-venom stuff, but I think we're good? Yeah, maybe? I, I still want to make as much of this as I possibly can. Okay, and now I'm missing what? Red tea again? What else do I need to do? This is a whole bunch of piddling, but I promise you it leads to something. What? I'm not sure, but it does. Uh, drop those off, and I have got batter, which goes into- hold on. Uh, recipes was the pecan- Pancakes and the roast dunner, so let me set these in here for now. Um, because I've got one in here already, right? I did I was able to make one. Alright. So I've got each one of these, and these are the all the top tiers, right? I don't think the apple pie is gonna give me anything, even though it's a pretty intensive thing. Just like grandma used to make. Okay, let's try an apple pie. See if it does anything else. I mean, it's got the max stamina bonus, but it doesn't have any of the candy stuffs, so... Okay. I have got... Uh, Grandpa's learning elixir, which is where? Takes two cans of dog food and one beer, so I've got enough to make 13 more. Do I have that coming with red tea? Yes, I do. So I can make 13 if I'm patiently waiting on all of this, or I just wait for... Ah, oh, jeez. 26 red teas. Dadgummit, I was hoping to get all this stuff done. It's already halfway through the day, and I've just been piddling around in my stuff. Though technically, I guess I could be putting away things from my previous adventure. That wouldn't be a bad idea, especially since some of it happens to be food, and that's what I'm tinkering with. Now, I want to hold on to those to remember that I'm actually making those, because the next horde night would be a whole lot better if I could actually use those. 
Okay, speaking of Horde Knight, I need to go make some modifications. Oh my gosh, my nose. Stop itching. Horde base prep. Uh, let's work on some of the stuff and things that I know we need to work on. Oh, where did I put it? Up here. And it's supposed to be a lot better for what I'm trying to do. I just don't think it's going to last. So maybe I should make my own multi-tool. What does that take? Electrical parts, forged steel, electrical parts, uh, forged steel, ah, I've got forged steel, are you talking about titanium? Uh, Multi-tool? Probably. Titanium and steel, okay. And energy cells, okay. Multi-tool, laser workbench, laser ooh. I kind of want to try that out. Craft me one of those. Um, and then craft me, I can only make a 21. Oh my gosh, the level is going to take so long to get up to 80. Uh, just make two of those. I'll see if I can completely repair the 46. I'm not going to try any more than that because using up these energy cells, just bad idea altogether. There. Eh, I've made all of those that I can. Okay, Grandpa's Learning Elixir can get stashed in there for, actually, while I'm building and upgrading, may not be a bad idea to have a couple of those. If I can get my tool upgraded just slightly. I wonder if it would work better if I put mods on it too. You know, I, I don't even think about that. I don't know that it will. Everything is better with lasers. Good for slicing and dicing zombies can also be used to butcher meat. Wah. Cool. I kind of want it to sound like a lightsaber, though. I'll be honest with you. Okay, I'm going to set you right here and play with you later. I need to put mods into you. I'm actually waiting on this thing. Oh, that actually fully healed you. I might actually just save that one to heal it back up after it's done. It's going to take forever for me to try and get it up to level 80 with my current rate, so I think we're good. Okay, well, let's go do some upgrades! Let's do some changes! Okay, last time I said I wanted to block this part off and force them back this way. Bring this side back. Uh, where's my center point? Right here. Okay, so if I bring these, let me use my rebar frame. If I bring these guys, I'm going to have to break this. That's bad. If I bring you guys up here, uh, that's one, two, three, four. That's probably the most I want to go with it. And take off one here. So that'll be five. Um, I could technically... Shift them over a little bit, maybe? Or do I just leave it? One, two, three, four, five. And push them over here towards the center. Now, after it comes to the center, it's actually pretty well blocked from my turrets, which means my turrets can focus a little bit further out. You know what? I might just do that. I'm pretty sure at some point these things are going to get beaten half to death, and there's going to be no point in me having done this. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, learning elixir, please. Use that. And since I am trying to carve them a path over here, let me just do that. Okay. Uh, block this side in as well. Uh, get it out! At least this way it forces the guys that are coming in towards the center instead of hanging out in the wings. Oh my god, the upgrading is so much faster. Okay, just gotta be careful with those, that's fine. Okay, and um, let's just do this. I, I don't have the patience to go back and get the proper ones for this. There we go. 
too wide. Most of the zombies will fit through, even if they're kind of glitching. So I don't think I actually need to do anything with that. I think this should work. I'm not guaranteeing it's going to work. And there's probably going to be a zombie that is going to wreck house and take them out. And you know, it's kind of okay because this is just a blind and it's probably not going to last through all of the Horde Knights. Uh, it's already been established that this was not a good design to go with just because of the types of zombies that are in here. Which I wasn't taking into account when I started the playthrough. That's fine. Thankfully it does not seem like it's degrading very fast, so that's good. There we go. Okay, dokie, that is all four sides, correct? Yeah. Okay, uh, I don't have any scrap iron on me to fix those and then upgrade them past that, so let me go grab some scrap iron. Sadly, some of these would just be easier to upgrade them than replace them. Uh, I think less resource intensive, possibly, maybe. Hate to do it, but... I mean, I've already spent the resources into making other things, so... Okay. Okay. Uh, let me get you guys filled back in. Okay. Steal all the way around. Cool. Uh, now we need to go in here, make sure these guys have been replaced and or upgraded. Um, oh yeah. Okay, and another thing that I see having an issue is, is zombies that are taller than this trying to get back out. I'm not sure how that's gonna go. Um, I guess I'll just have to keep an eye out for them, but, uh, for the most part this seems to be okay-ish. Uh, a lot of stuff needs upgrading and a lot of stuff needs, like this, I don't understand their obsession with just hitting this. I think it's because I can't see through there so I can't hurt anybody that's over there. There we go. Upgrade you. A little less playing around with my stuff, and if you don't mind. Okay, uh, so out of all the things that I've seen zombies doing, playing with random stuff and things, that's definitely one of the things that they're doing, but... Sir, I, ju I just, I just fixed those! Could you not? There we go. Hmm. Okay, dokie. Okay. So, all of this stuff has been upgraded that doesn't take care of some of my problems because, well, some of my problems are just basic stuff. I hear you. Dude! Don't do it! Hi, Karen. I'm trying to fix it up. Not allow you guys to destroy it. Not that it's stopping me from getting on my spikes, but you know what? They're mine. I put them in. That's all of that. Now it makes me wonder if I need to worry about the walls up top because with that lady, she really likes demoing stuff, but I kind of feel like I need to focus on this. But how do I fix this problem? Um. Anything I do is probably going to have to dry at this point, so let's fix this problem here. The issue is, is if she sees me, she is going to fire. The problem is, is if I put that block there, it might be seen, even though it's a plate, it might be seen as a pathway. Well, those aren't following laws of physics. Alright, now if I do this, it 
There. Hopefully that will stop her from getting in here with me. I'll have to upgrade that probably all the way up, but... She can't shoot at me unless she's in my face. If that's indeed how it works, that means she's going to have to come out to the front in order to attack me. Now, can I put some protection on this side as well? <laughs> okay. Uh, no. No. On face. Uh, do that. I'm not sure if they're going to see that as a pathway of any sort, but maybe they won't? I say without not a whole lot of faith in it. You know what I'm saying? Especially since some of the bigger bad guys are most certainly going to try and reach through this thing to get to me. But if they have to do that, that means they backed me up into a corner anyway. Let's do this. All the way across, that way all of my supports are connected. Okay, uh, so the next thing I need to upgrade is the roof and the inside of it because I'm pretty sure she could tear apart most of this. Like tissue paper. Who's out here planting my stuff? I hear you. Oh. You're probably that puddle now. And I'm gonna have to upgrade that, so... I think we're done for now unless I want to go around and do the floors. I mean, I've got plenty of concrete, but I'm not sure if I actually want to spend that kind of time. Oh, and I have <laughs> these stacks. No, I've got plenty of uh, Learn Elixir for the next couple of days. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, it's supposed to be the daytime of the next episode, so I probably should cut it. We did a whole lot of random stuff and mostly piddling around with the new opened uh, perk, trying to see what the food does. And we're going to slowly learn that one, too. You have a wonderful day. Stay shy. Bye!